Hi there, this is Craig Beck from StopDrinkingExpert.com. And today's video is especially for you if you've ever believed or said, I drink red wine because it's good for my heart. <laughs> my favorite argument. Oh, where do we start? Look, here's the truth. I'm just going to hit you with it between the eyes. Every single story you have seen about red wine being good for the heart, if you look in the small print, you will find the alcohol industry funded the report in some way. Every single time. Because it has been proven without doubt that red wine is no better for your heart than red grape juice. In fact, a lot of the surveys have come to the conclusion that the alcohol completely obliterates the benefits of the antioxidants in the grape skins. But you never hear people waxing lyrical and preaching about red grape juice, do you? You just don't hear it. Nobody ever gets really offended if you, said, if you say red grape juice isn't good for your heart. Why? Well, because red grape juice doesn't facilitate and validate a drug addiction. Drinkers like social proof. We like anything that validates what we believe. It's called confirmation bias. And when you see that story on Facebook that says, breaking news, red wine proven to be good for your heart, isn't there a little bit of you that goes, yes, I knew it, share, like. But it's, it's you know, if you do any research at all, you will find somewhere buried in the small print some PR company linked to a drinks manufacturer. Red wine is not good for your heart. It is not a reason to drink it. If you want to get that benefit, drink something with antioxidants in it. It doesn't have to be in a pretty bottle. If red wine was really good for your heart, when people had a heart attack, and went to the emergency room, the doctors would go, Merlot, stat, wouldn't they? But they don't, because it's not good for your heart. So, you see, the way my, my course works, the way my coaching works, is by stripping away the nonsense, stripping away the lies that support this drug in, so in society. Everything that we believe about alcohol is a lie. Everything that alcohol claims to do for us is the opposite. Alcohol claims to help us get to sleep. Actually, alcohol prevents sleep, damages sleep. If it was true that alcohol helped us get to sleep, then all drinkers would wake up in the morning feeling fresh, full of energy and vitality. Is that true? Nonsense. So, the way this course works is just by stripping away the foundations that have been supporting your beliefs that have enabled you to carry on drinking for so long. And it is only your beliefs and the physical addiction that has kept this loop going. And we can deal with the physical addiction. I'll show you how to deal with that. The psychological addiction is just a learning process or an unlearning process. Let me give you an example. If you're looking for something to give you a buzz, to make you feel high, to help you deal with stress and relax and deal with the strains of life, then why don't you use heroin? Much better than alcohol. The high feels fantastic. Why don't you use heroin? The answer is because you don't believe that adding heroin into your life would be a good decision. There's no social proof around you to validate that. And so you just, you don't believe it, so you don't do it. But with alcohol, you have been taught repeatedly and you've watched repeatedly that adding alcohol into your life is a good thing. So you believe it and whatever you believe you will reproduce. So look, I want to encourage you. If you are currently miserable, if you can feel your business failing, your career going downhill, you're worried about your reputation. I mean, what would happen if you got a DUI? All these things are starting to play in your mind. Then I encourage you to take action today. This is not going to go away on its own. 
You need someone to help you. And if you're anything like me, you want that help without having to stand up in a room full of strangers and label yourself an alcoholic or to take dangerous prescription medication or to take weeks and weeks off work and spend tens of thousands of dollars at rehab. I didn't want any of that. I just wanted to deal with it quickly and privately. And if that's you, you need me. So I encourage you to go to stopdrinkingexpert.com, fill out the application, and let's see if we're a good fit. Let's see if we can work together because I want to work with you personally, one-to-one, -to, -one, to coach you out of this problem. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and get in touch if you have any questions at all. See you in the next video.